hey guys what's up welcome to my channel thank you so much for joining in if it is not your first time i thank you so much for coming back and guys if it is your first time thank you so much i really and truly appreciate that also uh how you can support my channel you can just go ahead and hit that subscribe button so i can always be able to, to, to add more content to my youtube thank you guys so much all right so in today's video I'll speak about my home studio and this is the reason I haven't been posting anything on YouTube for maybe over a month now because I was busy working on my home studio and I wanted it to be good enough so you guys can like learn from it and to see how you guys can set up a budget studio also. So I have my budget studio right here but before I show you guys I'll just go ahead and show you like a behind the scenes and just a few photos that I've taken in my home studio and you guys can comment and tell me what you think about the results and yeah maybe you can also guess the type of equipment that I'm using but anyway after that behind the scenes what I'll do I'll go ahead and then I'll just show you in the studio and I will show you each equipment that I'm using and yeah so maybe you guys can go ahead and set up a budget studio which I'm believe me like this it will take your work to another level because you will have enough time to go ahead and do some experiment you can play with lighting and then you'll find what you love I spend most of my time here but anyways watch behind the scenes and then when you come back we'll definitely speak more about photography equipment okay please peace peace hey guys what's up welcome back to another episode of my vlog and today it's an amazing episode right I'm shooting with the lovely Kashika from Mauritius uh, second time around and I'm sure she is gonna love it I'm gonna love it and you guys will love it also but the good thing is I'm doing it inside of my home inside of my home studio um, I wanted to show you guys this for so long but it is now here so stick around and watch what is taking place how are you, by the way how are you feeling? <laughs> I'm great <laughs> wonderful, wonderful give this video a like, a thumbs up I don't know, subscribe, subscribe. to my subscribe <laughs> ah, thank you so much <laughs> alright see, see ya Welcome back to another episode of my vlog and guys, it has been so long. So I've put together something nice with Mr. Jene from Jamaica, that is. Anyways, I'm in my home studio guys and trust me, this is a wonderful place. Like, I've worked so hard to get the pieces together. It's cheap but it's worth it. Um, yeah, I'll show you around and stuff like that. Uh, anything you want to say before the video or after the video? I have to say, shoots are not easy guys. But it was... <laughs> I'm so hungry. <laughs> But it was really, really fun. It was a great experience. I got the homey feeling and, you know, it was just like good vibes, good energy, all of that good stuff. Anyways, I'd also like you guys to subscribe to Telling Me Unscripted. There's going to be a link in the description box somewhere down here. Yeah, we're basically like new, upcoming, fresh, young, vibrant, bubbly YouTubers. So just support us and support um, K-Snaps case case all the time. Yeah man, so guys, run go check our page out, our their page out, it is really dope, like you'll laugh, you'll cry, whatever, you'll have fun. So thank you again so much for tuning into my channel and yo, I really appreciate it, love, peace. Okay guys, so welcome back. I hope you have enjoyed that behind the scenes and I hope you are impressed with my photos also. Um, yeah, so let's get into what I have in my studio and how I do things. Alright, so to start out guys, I have my 85mm 1.8, like this is my favorite lens. The problem is the space is a little bit tight, so with this lens what I do is I try to get the upper body, like 
headshots, like corporate headshots or uh, face shots or stuff like that. Uh, this is my not so favorite anymore since I was introduced to the 85, but the 50 mm, like this is really, really good. I can get like from knee height, uh, I can also get full bodies, but I try to use it for maybe knee height up, right? So, yeah, this is my 50 mm. So, also, I use the Nikon 24 to 70, that is the one that I'm vlogging on right now. And the camera body that I use is the Nikon D780. This is my laptop, this is a old it's a little bit old but I think it's more than capable of doing the work I've also upgraded the RAM so that is it's perfect it's a Asus K501 I think I bought it back in 2016 2017 there about recently I've added the Samsung 24 inch um, 1080 yeah full HD so this is amazing like this shows me textures that I haven't or I wasn't able to see on this so I'm really happy for the second monitor um all right so in my studio i use the godox 8200 for my master light and also i use a 130 centimeters softbox right it is double diffused so you know you have real soft light coming out on the model's face like this is perfect for like headshots and stuff like that so you know the lighting will wrap around the person's face like perfectly and for slave, I use the Young No 660. It's a perfect strobe, yeah, for slave, which is good. And I use one of those rectangular soft boxes, like for that side light or that rim light. Yeah, that's what I do, and it's perfect. Yeah, I re I really appreciate the results that I've gotten from it. And this is my favorite stool, wonderful stool. Like yeah, and I have two top for this stool. I have a black and I have a red. A few backdrops. I have a black, I have a pink, I have a yellow, and also I have a white. And the reason for the white is I want to get, I want to be able to stretch it so you can sit on it, you can lie on it or whatever. Because as you know, the floor is like wood color, like a natural wood color. Um, this stand right here, the the backdrop stand, I got it for maybe ten to fifteen US dollars, and it is amazing. Like it is. 3 meters wide, yeah it can go up to 3 meters wide, but now I think it's like 2.5 meters wide, but that's good enough for me, I have the extension for it, but this room I cannot go any wider, but this is, it, it is perfect, um, yeah, so whenever I need I just roll, I just change rolls, like, yeah, whatever backdrop I need, and also using a colored backdrop, it will give me the flexibility of using Photoshop to change the color as much as I want. Hi guys, so I've just started this studio, so I hope you guys loved or like what you have seen. And you can comment and let me know how I can, how I can improve my setup and what you would like to see me shoot in the studio. Everything is welcome on this channel and thank you guys so much again. Uh, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Please go ahead and give my video a thumbs up if you thought it was interesting. And also... Yeah, feel free to send me a message on my Instagram if you need to ask any further questions or send me an email. Alright guys, thank you so much for watching this video. I really and truly appreciate the love. I really and truly appreciate the support. Um, as I said, like if it's your first time here and you haven't subscribed, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button so you can help my channel grow and I can put out more content for you guys. Um, yeah, thank you so much again and peace. Ah, peace.